I realized we didn't change the slide title. <laughs> right. But yeah, today I just gave the demo day presentation at Raquel. Um, I'm Manapam Patak, and I'm the CEO of Lift Labs. And I'm here to talk about a new technology that we've been developing that can is designed to actively cancel unintentional motion. So that can come from Parkinson's disease or essential tremor. So next time, next time you sit down for a meal, I want you to try and imagine what it would be like if you had the same level of frustration that you had last time you were trying to thread a needle. When you were trying to get the thread through the eye of the needle and you're this normal hand tremor was starting to like get in the way and interfere with what you're trying to do. And then try and imagine what it would be like to have that same level of frustration when you're just trying to eat just a bowl of soup. So bringing the spoon up to your mouth would be just as difficult. And being able to eat without spilling, and without embarrassing yourself, would be just as difficult as threading that needle. So that's the reality that millions of people in the U.S. have to face. And uh, as, as something that you get when you age, uh, essential tremor is something that really starts to affect and gets worse and worse as people get older. And also Parkinson's disease. There are some people with Parkinson's that have this sort of uh, tremor when they're trying to do basic tasks. Right now there are medications on the market, but they're not specifically designed for these diseases. So they're, they're typically prescribed on a trial and error basis. And uh, a lot of the time, about 50% of the time, they don't even work. And the other 50% of the time, there's side effects that people have to deal with. So for the remaining people, the only thing out there really is uh, sort of a last resort, which is a brain surgery. And uh, as I said, this is a last resort because it's, it's an invasive procedure. There are complications, risks involved. A lot of people are very wary to get something like this. So there is a large group of people that are actively looking for other, other, other forms of solutions. Some people have uh, worked on developing technologies that can help stop the person's tremor from occurring. So you can see behind me um, this big arm brace. So the idea is that you know if my hand is shaking, you can actually, if someone came up to me and actually start, tried to stop my hand from moving, um, you can do that, but you, got, you need a lot of structure. This needs a lot of force. And the user might try to fight with this. It's not very an, a natural feeling. And nobody's really going to want to go out in public wearing something like that. So what we thought, and what I was working on for my, my PhD work, was um, why not stop whatever you're trying to hold from moving? And so that's the idea with the lift forward device. And it's something that's very portable, and it's intuitive to use. You just put whatever attachment you want on the end and uh, the device will accommodate for the tremor. So we're starting out with a spoon. That's some of the feedback we got from the support groups. They said they really want something to help with eating. But the idea is that this is almost like a Swiss Army knife that you could use in daily life. So we're going to be coming out with more and more attachments. So we're already, you know, other sorts of eating utensils are already being designed right now. But we plan to go beyond that. And we did clinical studies last year at the University of Michigan, and we showed with a patient population on average, average a 70% tremor reduction. With people with more severe tremor, we tended to have even more tremor reduction. So we have a lot of technology inside, um, but the idea is that we package this away so the user doesn't have to deal with any of this. There's not even an on-off button. So you just put the utensil on or whatever the attachment is and the device will activate. Last week we launched the product, so we're taking pre-orders. And uh, we also partnered with a, a large foundation. The idea is that for people who cannot afford to pay out of pocket right now, we're taking donations to help subsidize to, the, to people identified by the foundation. So these are people that, you know, might be living paycheck to paycheck, but they are really suffering. We want to be able to help them as well. Our team involves myself and uh, former controller at HP, so our CFO. And um, we also have a solid design and engineering team, as well as uh, advisory board. So Dr. Ashton at UCSF and uh, 
Dr. Chu worked with me for a couple of years on this project. So before I show the video, um, we, we have various people. If you can go on our website, we have a lot more videos of people using our first product. Berta, was, uh, you're about to see, has um, been, we actually were on a TV show a couple of days ago called The Doctors, and we had kind of done a, like a um, overview of how, how the spoons really helped her. And we can, you can see on our website, you know, her eating and, and talking about it. But what I really wanted to share with you today was her very first experience, which was at a support group. And this is her just kind of like trying it out for the first time. Okay, we're gonna get Yeah. And I'll see you as the left door one more time. Oh, it just turns on all by itself, mm -hmm. it? Yeah. That's pretty cool. All right, here we go. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That just makes all the difference in the world, I'm telling you. Yeah. It really does. Mm -hmm. I'm going to see if I can do this without pulling my head forward because I like to be able to eat like a normal mm -hmm. person for a change. <laughs> That's nice. Yeah. Awesome. <laughs> yeah. So while we're taking orders from people who need it, what I really wanted to, I mean, um, reach out, I, I saw this at Demo Day as well is I really encourage people who really like like what we're doing and want to support our technology to donate and really help us impact the lives of people um, through the foundation. So I set up on our website, there's a little spoon with a, with a level on there. And um, so every time a spoon gets paid for, you'll, you might like you push it over and you'll get a notification that we'll, we'll ship another one. But you can do different increments. Um, so yeah, just go on our website and we have videos of whatever else you want to see. Thanks. Awesome. Yeah.